Hey guys, it's me, Kezia Noble, leading female dating and attraction expert for men. Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you the best way to approach and start a conversation with a woman who is looking at her phone. A very common situation this day and age. I'll also show you how you can change your mindset and your perception of any situation which will allow you to confidently approach and engage with any woman you want. How many times have you seen a really cute girl and she is just in her own world scrolling through her phone? You probably avoid those situations thinking that it's going to be too intrusive, but it's not intrusive. Intrusive is interrupting someone's phone call conversation or interrupting them if they're in the middle of a strenuous workout. Think about it. Would you have any hesitation approaching a woman who is sort of browsing through a magazine, change your perception. The book, the magazine, her phone are not barriers. They are talking points. They are props that you can use to start a conversation. Most of the time, people are on their phones out of boredom. Remember that phone scrolling is the modern equivalent of magazine browsing. You wouldn't consider a huge disturbance to approach someone browsing through a magazine or a newspaper, so don't consider it a huge disturbance to approach someone looking through crap on their phone. And believe me, 90% of the time, it is crap. So casually go up to her and make a cheeky and playful statement, such as, no, it's really nice to see someone scrolling through their phones. Everybody else is just looking at a book these days. It is cheeky and that's why you need to remember to deliver this with a smile. Or you can say TikTok or Instagram. Or are you stuck on that YouTube algorithm rabbit hole? Now, you might think that she's going to tell you to fuck off. But you'll be surprised at how many times this actually makes a woman smile. This is what we advise the majority of our students to do when approaching a woman who's on her phone. And the majority of them get really positive responses. Again, remember everything that I teach in my videos is not theory. They have all been tried and tested. Now what you next do is very important and it needs to be done correctly. Follow it up with something about yourself which is connected to the opening line. Example, you could say, I'm currently on a social media detox. I found that people are actually quite interested when you say that to them. People find it quite fascinating because they kind of want to do it to themselves. So that could be a nice little thing that you can put in there to just spark her interest. Or you could say, I've become totally addicted to this like TikTok trend that's going around or whatever it is. Again, it's something current, something that she'll probably have an opinion on and that she'll want to share with you. Hey, just a quick message before you continue watching the video. If you want to start getting real results with women and begin living the reality you want, then find out how myself and my incredible team of experts can make this happen for you. After you've watched the video, go to my website, kezia-noble.com, and you will find more information about the seven day mastery program. This is a full immersion experience where you will receive one-on-one -on -one training throughout the entire seven days. Whatever points of struggle you have, we will deliver you the solution. Whatever objectives you want us to help you to achieve, we will do everything to ensure that happens for you. We have been helping men turn their dreams into a reality on our programs since 2006. So we know exactly what to do to get you where you want to be. Every single man who attends our seven day mastery program or our acceleration home training mentorship receives a completely tailor-made experience where the coaching is designed to meet all your personal goals whilst remaining 100% aligned with your personal values and expectations. This is so much more than just a dating and attraction program because you'll discover that all the new skills and insights you gain are easily transferable to other areas of your life and well-being, including your career, social encounters, and your overall confidence. It's time to start living the reality you want and the reality that you deserve. Okay, back to the video. With these kind of openers, these kind of cheeky, quick openers, it's important to make sure that you transition from that opening line to mid-game or full-blown conversation as quickly as possible. You shouldn't even puncture that flow with an introduction. The key here is to lead the interaction, take control of the direction. It's no good to just dispense the opening line, get a smile from her, and then wait for her to engage. That just won't happen. Presume she's happy to talk. 
If you think you're being intrusive, that will reflect in your body language. Being awkward makes the situation awkward. So when you use these kind of playful or cheeky openers, it has to be delivered with self-assurance. Take it as a given that she will respond and engage and you'll see how often this is exactly what happens. Now, although the opening line does carry some importance, particularly in potentially awkward situations where she's distracted or she's doing something else, what's paramount here is your perception of the situation. Being able to switch potential barriers into talking points knowing how to transition from openness to conversation, presuming she wants to talk, and letting go of limiting beliefs and uncertainty, which will make the interaction more dynamic and natural, as opposed to awkward or intense. All these micro changes in your mindset and conversation skills will give you the ability to approach and connect with many women in a wide scope of environments and situations. A lot of our students come to us with really bad approach anxiety, and this is just one of the things that we teach to help them overcome that anxiety. It's important for them to know what to say and do in all situations. So yes, it's a combination of inner game, changing your perception, changing your mindset for sure. But the other 50% is really knowing what to say, what to say next, how to transition from the opening line to a full-blown conversation. So if you want to be able to approach a woman in any situation, in any environment, we find out how we can help you to achieve that. All you have to do is go to the website, kezia nobelcom and you'll find out more about our programs there, such as our seven-day mastery program and our Acceleration Online Training Mentorship. You'll also see a wide collection of student video testimonials that we have received over the years, and some of them might resonate with you personally. Okay, thank you so much for watching this video. If you liked it, please remember to give it a thumbs up, and I hope to see you soon on one of my live events. Take care.